Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to refund on Gumroad. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now in help.gumroad.com where I found a guide that perfectly explained everything about issuing a refund. So in this article, we're going to see the full refund, partial refund, PayPal refund and so on. So this is the full refund. Go to your sales dashboard and click on the sale to open the customer drawer. Then scroll down and click the refund fully button. We charge and refund customers in USD. The amount customers receive back in their local currency may be different than what they initially paid due to differences in exchange rates. Partial refund. To issue a partial refund, enter the amount to be refunded in the refund box and click issue partial refund. Your customer will still have access to their content after a partial refund. Right now we're going to see PayPal refund. If you refund a PayPal Connect purchase, PayPal keeps its fees on the sale but refund 100% of the amount to the customer. In this case, you would be responsible for PayPal fees. After issuing a refund, customers receive an email confirmation after a refund is issued. Credit card funds usually take 5 to 10 business days to appear on the buyer's account while PayPal refunds are immediate. In that case, of a full refund, customers will no longer be able to access the content or receive the respective products updates. Refunding a customer fully will also delete any product rating they're given. So this is it guys for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.